In this video, you will learn how to use data logging on your PRC communication device. This feature on your device will record the date and time of every word or phrase spoken. Please remember that this data represents personal communication and respect privacy accordingly. First, you will learn how to connect your device to Wi-Fi. Next, you will learn how to connect your device to Realize Language. Then you will learn how to turn data logging on. From there, you can log on to the Realize Language website to see your data. To turn Wi-Fi on, enter the toolbox, then select the Maintenance menu. It is a yellow key in the second row. From there, select Hardware Diagnostics, and then Network Setup. At this point, you will see the desktop. If you are using Windows 7, select Connect to a Network and then choose your Wi-Fi network to connect to. If you are in Windows 8, close the window in the middle of the screen and then open the Charms menu by swiping from the right edge of the screen towards the center. From the Charms menu, select Settings and then the Wireless Network icon. Select the wireless network you would like to connect to. You may have to enter a password if the network is password protected. Once you have connected to a Wi-Fi network, select the new voice icon to maximize the software. Then select OK, and then OK again. The device is now connected to Wi-Fi. It is now time to connect the device to Realize Language. To do this, select Review Vocab Menu, and then Data Analysis. Then select Realize Language Account. Enter your Realize Language Account email address. Then select OK. It is now time to enter your Realize Language account password. Once entered, select OK again. It is now time to associate a specific person to this device and your Realize Language account. To do this, select the Realize Language account key again. If a keyboard automatically pops up, this means that you have to create a device user profile for Realize Language. Type the name of the person who uses the device. In this example, I will enter Edward. Then select OK. If instead of a keyboard, you see a list of names, either select the name of the person using the device or select Create Person and follow the prompts. From here, I will select Edward. Now turn Sync Automatically on. The device is now connected to Realize Language. The current status box in the center of the screen tells you if data logging is set to on or off, when a last report was sent to Realize Language, the status of the connection to the server, as well as the email address and person associated with the account. It is now time to turn data logging on. Select OK. Look to the right to find data logging. Now select On under Data Logging. You will notice a green L or this red symbol in the status bar. This indicates that data logging is on. From this menu, you can also see how many bytes of data are collected. In this example, I can tell I am starting with a blank slate because there are zero bytes of data collected. If you see a number here other than zero, that means you have already collected some data. You can either keep it and add to it, or clear it out if you are not interested in looking at it. That is up to you. The device is now set to collect data. Select OK, and then go to Home. Now, when I say something, it will be recorded.
At any time, you can log into the Realize Language website to view the data. The data log will be displayed in a calendar format. In addition, the data is represented in other easy-to-understand pictures and graphs, such as a word cloud. Realize Language helps you track progress, determine patterns of use, and inform AAC intervention. Thank you for learning how to do web-based data logging with Realize Language and your accent.